Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while since I've done a video, but you know, that's life. <laughs> Things happen. But anyway, so I am back. This is two different collective hauls from Walmart, and if you hear something in the background, that is my husband mowing. Um, so I got a lot more wax melts, and some of them are repeats. Uh, this one right here is Better Homes and Gardens Warm Tobacco Leaf. And this one is so good. Um, it's just a earthiness with a, a sweet tone there. It's, it's really good. And I've already melted a couple cubes of my other one and I love it. It smells so so good on warm it really does and let's see then I got better homes and gardens pumpkin berry tart this one just sounded really really good that's what it looks like I don't smell any pumpkin in this one but I smell like a berry tart it's definitely like a berry bakery it's really nice really nice if you like bakery then I got better homes and gardens spiced woodland current now see I smelled this one before I was kind of on the fence about it it's a really pretty dark purple color I love this this kind of smells like it smells kind of like the tobacco leaf. I get the tobacco leaf note, but there's like a berryness to it. Like, it says current, but to me, it almost smells kind of like blackberry mixed with the tobacco leaf, is what it smells like to me. It smells really nice really nice then I got sensationals applewood go out on the limb and I'm sorry if this lighting really sucks just trying to do with what I got that's what it looks like this is really sweet um, you can definitely smell apples like a crisp Macintosh apple I don't really get a woody note though. Um, there is something else in here besides the apple. I can't place it, but it smells really good. It, it does. It smells. I don't get like. Hmm. I'm not for sure, but I like it. Oops. Then I got Better Homes and Gardens Fall into Autumn. This one I like. And that's what that looks like. This one smells like baked apples and spices. It smells like Bath and Body Works Leaves Candle. It, yeah. It smells exactly like leaves to me. Um, really, really, really nice. Then I got Sensational Spice Cupcakes with Vanilla Buttercream. That looks like... I definitely get the spices. It smells like a little bit of cinnamon and clove. Um, I get the buttercream. It's, it's kind of like a pumpkin spice, a pumpkin spice mixed with buttercream. Really, really good. Then I got Better Homes and Gardens of Vanilla Caramel Spice. This one is good too. And with this one, I'm going to pop it out. This one, I smell the vanilla and I can smell the caramel in it. 
and the spice, it definitely smells cinnamony to me. But I don't know if you can see on the back, you can see like the redness I'm assuming is from the cinnamon. And normally I do not like cinnamon, but when it is mixed well with other scents, I can handle it. And this one smells good. Um, let's see here. Then I got the one that a lot of people have been talking about. Better Homes and Gardens Moonlit Magic Pumpkin. And this one is Black Wax. This one, I wasn't... I, I just wasn't sure about it. I'm still not sure. It, it's got a smokiness to it to me. Kind of like a tobacco -y smell. But not like the tobacco leaf. It's a little bit smokier smelling. It's very earthy, kind of reminds me of patchouli. It, it, it's really different. <laughs> it's different. So I don't know if I'm going to like this on warm. On cold, I'm kind of like, I, I, I'm, I'm not for sure yet. I'm not for sure. I'll make up my mind when I melt it. Then I got um, Mainstays Pumpkin Spice. And these. That's what that looks like. This one. It definitely has pumpkin spice, but you can also smell like the pumpkin puree in here. You can definitely get like the pumpkin guts of your pie. Smells really, really good. And I thought this would be really good to mix with some of my other pumpkin scents. Then I got Better Homes and Gardens Cranberry Mandarin Splash. And I picked up two. For when you get tired of the heavy bakery scents and this one just smells so fruity orange I can smell the cranberry it's just such a light and I don't mean light as in that I think it's gonna have a light throw just lift you up light you know um, very fruity it's a beautiful fruity scent and I believe they've had this one for quite a few years they bring this out every year but yeah, I had to get that one. I got some of these big value packs. I got the Better Homes and Gardens Vanilla Cookie Crunch. And I think just about everybody knows about Vanilla Cookie Crunch. You know. This one is a vanilla cookie. A vanilla sugar cookie. It's just it's really nice and I always use this as a mixer and I got this because I wanted to mix this with my tobacco leaf because I thought it would make like a be a dupe for the vanilla uh, tobacco candle from root or vanilla tobacco however they say it then my husband picked this one out sensationals perfectly pine dreams of the forest they've had this for years and it smells like a pine tree exactly it smells like a pine tree and this one I will do closer to Christmas uh, he loves pine scents and the one that he really liked <laughs> Better Homes and Gardens Fresh Cut Frasier and it smells like a Frasier fir tree um to me, this one and Perfectly Pine smell very, very close, but he said that he could tell the difference between the scents, so I guess you can smell, like he said cedar. I, I can get that. This one's got like a little bit of a cedar note to it, but yeah, like I said, Christmas. Then I got another value pack, um, the crisp fall leaves.
Um, that's what that looks like. And I didn't think I'd like this one, so I didn't even like smell it before. And I'm not sure, is, this is not a limited edition. I think, yeah, it does say limited edition, but I think this was out last year. I'm not for sure. But this one smells so good. Oh my gosh. I can smell a little bit of um, like orange in here. It's got an orangey scent to it. And it's got subtle spices, but I can't quite, you know, pick out what they are. But yeah, I like that one. Then, let's see. Then I got some of these um, dual scented ones. Um, this one is Better Homes and Gardens Spiced Apple Pie. On one side is apple pie and the other side is clove. And that's what they look like. And yes. And that clove is really super, super strong. Just straight up clove. Yeah. That one smells good. The apple pie one. And I think I, be I believe I have a clamshell on the apple pie by itself. Yeah. And they smell really good together. So... That's a good one. And then I have another dual one from Better Homes. Um, Autumn Afternoon Stroll, Golden Oak Leaves and Apples and Acorns. This one is really great. That's what it looks like. This one smells so good together, the combination. Oh gosh, I can't even explain. You got that leaves smell, kind of like from the last one I showed. And the apple. I don't know if I smell acorns, but it's really good together. Really, really digging on that. And then something else I got, not from Walmart, but from Dollar General, that I wanted to show you before they like quit selling them. I took the price tag off, but these were $3. It's a cute little um, owl tea light. They have them in this green color. They have like a burnt orange color and a white. But I just thought he was so cute. And it holds, I'd say probably two wax cubes would be too much. I put one in here and yeah, I think about one would probably do you. But with the tea lights, it makes the scent stronger. So, like, if you have some really weak wax, this one would be a good one to use. And, of course, your tea light just sits right in there. But I just thought he was so cute. So, anyway, I am still waiting on some vendor wax that I ordered over three weeks ago. Um, so, hopefully I will uh, have a haul on that. Um here towards the end of the week, I am hoping. Fingers crossed, I seems like I've been waiting forever for this wax. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you all have a great day and I'll talk to you later, bye.